Well, Alzheimer's and dementia caregivers in Chautauqua County, they're rallying together, speaking directly with local health care professionals about this deliberate, uh, debilitating disease that not only impacts patients, but their family too. Bronson Rasmussen joining us live now with from the newsroom with more on this important conversation. Bronson. Justin, the Western New York Office of the Aging, alongside the Alzheimer's Association, held two forums for caregivers in the city of Dunkirk and Jamestown this week, where they discussed a variety of topics when it comes to taking care of somebody with memory problems. Dementia is something that does not discriminate. Anyone, I, I challenge you to look for one person who hasn't been touched in some way by a loved one or a friend or a family member, a neighbor who is experiencing dementia, whether it's the stress of caregiving, whether it's an actual diagnosis. Um, and it's something we don't talk about enough as a community. It's a situation and a circumstance that's often seen as taboo. No one wants to admit that they're sick and especially not sick with dementia, but it's something that is not going away. There is no cure. Being a caregiver is stressful and full of challenges, especially when taking care of those with memory problems. This is really to support caregivers, um, to give them uh, the information they need to care for their loved one. No one wants to end their life in a nursing home. The past few years have been very difficult for caregivers, so those with the Alzheimer's Association has a challenge for those at home. If you know someone who is a caregiver, to, to truly ask them, what can I do in the next week that will be literally helpful to you and your situation? To help, new technology is coming out every year. During the pandemic, animatronic animals have been assisting those feeling lonely. He plays music and just interacts with you. And the more you move around, the more he interacts with you. And, you know, you would think that animatronic pets would not have the same uh, effect as a real pet, but they really do. Uh, studies are showing that these guys are really effective. And I was just showing him to somebody in the, the forum, and he got this huge smile on his face. There are several support groups that caregivers can take part in. With more information on the services in our region from the Alzheimer's Association at alz.org. Bronson Rasmussen, live in the newsroom, WNY News Now.